Assalamu alaikum and hi there. In this video, I would like to share a nifty little feature that I just discovered today in Canva. And that's this one here, the stylus. I was just playing around with this slide of mine. I was just trying to, you know, find icons for the places that I've been to, some ancient civilization, and recently I've been to Kedah Tua. And, and then um, what I found was that, very interesting, I could just simply go to, say, text. I add in, say, this one. Let's just close this one. You can enter the text as usual by using the keyboard. But you can also go here. Can, can you see that already? I was just thinking, what is that? And you can simply just go there right and then you can let me just put it somewhere you can see put a text under this icon for Angkor Wat which I visited last year so I'm gonna just click on this can you see quickly that it will show you this uh, icon for the stylus you can click on this we can see this is undo and that's to redo that's the mini keyboard all right and that's enter and you click on the three dots here you can just click on auto minimize or you can go to the pencil settings of the auto minimize this particular menu will just stay there for you know forever so i'm gonna just keep it there so that we can see the whole thing and then let's go back to here and let's just go to do that and i'm going to cut all that and then start writing so I'm going to put the okay let me just click on that select yes and I'm going to just delete that so I'm going to put the 9th century that's for the Angkor Wat yeah? and I can delete that put enter and I can just write down century okay that's that's really cool i don't have to go letter by letter in here so then um i'll just what i do next is i'll just select or so you can just go to you can see that i'll just undo it here and just select all i'll go to this three dots and what i want to do is that um sorry is the other way around I just go to Kedah Tua, I go to the three dots, I click on this particular, like a paint, the painter, and then I'm gonna just click on that, and it'll, straight away, it will just automatically um, format to the same text. So I can just bring it up here to Uncle Wat, I think it's around 9th century. And so, on. so that's the first one. The second one is that I'm going to show you, you can actually also um, use the same handwriting recognition yeah, in the text box. So just click on that, I'll go to elements and then I can just, can you see that it's starting to sh show up? So select everything, just uh, X there, just put Malaysia. Okay, can you see that? It's showing really well. It's actually recognizing my handwriting really well. So I'm gonna just click enter and it goes, you know, bring up all the uh, hits for the, the search item um, under Malaysia. And I can click on that again and <clears throat> say just space and I'm, I'm gonna just put in Malaysia say uh, icons and then click enter okay so you can from there you can just select the icons here all right i just want to share a new discovery in canva it's a new feature and i think it's a fantastic addition to the whole thing well, I can't wait to see if Canva are going to introduce, like, uh, you can use a stylus to start drawing or start sketching on uh, the, the slide, for example, to add in your own 
uh, handwritten notes and so on in this. It would be fantastic when combined with millions of elements you have in Canva. Thanks very much for watching. Click like or subscribe. I see you in the next video.